Defensive tackle Derek Brown is one of those guys that's becoming a little bit more common who loses his fifth star throughout the process and gains it back. Dante Fowler was one of those guys, Raquan McMillan. Uh, there have been many more in recent years. Um, and, and the reason being, you know, we wanted to see him be dominant at the point of attack and push the pocket as a pass rusher. And he did that at the U.S. Army All-American Bowl. He was right up there with Dexter Lawrence, in my opinion, when it comes to a dominant inside presence. In the game itself, you can watch the film, there were times where two and three, time, three guys were on him, and he still got that push. He's got quick feet, he's quick off the snap, he's very well built, plays with excellent leverage. So this is a 320 pound guy who can move um, and, and really also has very good pass rushing moves. Now he struggled you know, at the camp circuit. He, he had a, a very good senior season. We wanted to see him go against the best of the best, uh, and I think he did that. He handled the interior offensive line, uh, I think, pretty easily in practice on the E squad, and his performance in the game itself was dominant. Now, he's a guy that's not going to appear in the stat sheet that often. He's not going to get double-digit sacks. Um, he's not going to be a guy who gets double-digit tackles. But what he's going to do is he's going to take up a lot of blockers. He's going to push that pocket. He's going to put that quarterback under duress and make him get rid of the ball quicker than he wants to. And that's what makes him an elite guy in a 4-3 or a 3-4 set. So Derek Brown getting that fifth star back well-deserved.